Dang, what happened to it? Do you think lightning struck it or something? No, because... Bad storm? People? A bad storm, maybe. If it was lightning, this tree would explode. It would have shattered into a lot of pieces. You ever see video of like, a tree being struck by lightning? They fucking splinter. Yeah, I actually did see one <laughs> about it. And I was like, no! That's what happened to but the last... When I was, but when I was last through here, days ago, the main trunk was just laying across this part here, not that second uh, part. Maybe quad riders moved it. No, I think wind. I think uh -huh. just came from the knocked it over because it was going to That beautiful blue sky. Not a cloud in sight. Some more of them yellow flowers you like. Yeah. Someone around here loves planting them. I see. Ah, we're starting to come up on yeah, the way. other half. Way, yeah, the other half. The Richie Rich half. That has the Richie Rich houses. With the Richie Rich people. That don't have to worry about living, living rich being lives. evicted and all the other, you know, good joys. Uh, the kind that own their house probably don't have much to pay on their mortgage if they don't own it outright. Uh, yeah, we're coming on that area. Look at the odd shape <clears throat> of this tree. I'm like, what the I heck? actually know why that's like that. Why? Why is it like okay, that? Okay, so certain Native American tribes have had, had a tradition or some kind of like um thing where they would actually to use as like trail markers for trails yeah they would train trees to bend and grow in certain ways to act as natural land markers for trails oh okay that's why sometimes you'll see trees in the woods where both sides of the trunks are bent yeah in like fork shapes yeah americans did that while the tree was still young and growing they trained the tree to grow split in two different directions and grow up oh wow yeah, I don't know specifically what tribe did it, but I know a lot of the ones that were here in our area did practice that. Oh my goodness. Huh. This is why you see a lot of trees that have some really very sharply angled uh, trunks sometimes. Yeah, they look like, you know, oh my god, like what happened? You automatically think like <laughs> damage, a if storm were, or... If you were a uh, Native American coming through here, you'd see these, those trees and recognize them and be like, okay, I'm on a trail. I know where I'm going. Right. Ah, okay. Huh. That's like the first couple of clouds I've actually seen. Okay, yeah. Yeah, because it's been like amazing, beautiful blue sky. I think. Red Rooster, or wait, are we by Harley? Yeah, we're by Harley. Yeah, well, where the Red Rooster used to be. Yeah. So and down, Buzz. so, so, so down, down or up? Um, you know what, it's a nice day. 
What's... I don't know. Let's see here for a moment. What way we shall go. Okay. Uh, let me think of where you uh, see much interesting things. Let me see. Let me think. Well, not that towards town, I'll tell you that. <laughs> Hey guys, is any of this looking a little bit familiar? Last video when we took a walk in the woods. Ah, uh, I'll give you a little hint. The road to nowhere. And it came right up to... The road to nowhere leads to you. Yeah, the road to nowhere leads to me. And here is the guardrail, but I'm on the other side of the guardrail now. I am literally right across from the sign. Welcome to Milneville. That actually is the, the key. Yeah, I know. Oh, no. I know. So I'm trying to go a little bit slow. I really don't want to catch someone's house invade their privacy by putting their home in video. Um, this is a nice area for homes, though. A lot of these patch towns in Pennsylvania, that is where you will see a lot of really, really nice homes. Hang on. At one time, the logical thinking was it was cheaper to buy or rent land outside of the city and as a result, people built some beautiful homes in patch towns. Okay. But that's not the that case. Rock, that rock wall that we saw yeah. in the woods, it begins right here and wraps around. Ah, oh, okay. That rock wall. Oh, okay. Ronnie said it actually begins right over here on the left and goes around. Huh, interesting. Ah. <clears throat> so we were actually going to do a hike in Latimer, but we decided against it because we didn't, we didn't prepare for it. Yeah, we didn't prepare. We didn't bring extra water and snacks and everything. And that would be like a three, four hour hike. We would have a lot of video content, but. It would be a hike. So today was just the idea I wanted to go for a walk, enjoy the beautiful day, get out of the hotel room for a bit, and then tonight I can work on my Jeffree Star video. I can upload that tomorrow morning. Just watching my last Jeffree Star palette and using the beautiful green eyeliner that I got actually to go with the palette. I didn't know Ronnie was going to get it for me, but I did get the green eyeliner in the event I got that palette. So, some adorable little homes, like I said, I don't want to, you know, like invade someone's privacy, <coughs> putting their home on on a video, so if I can, I do it quick. And we're sometimes at night. Ronnie has to go for milk in a pinch. Uh, I don't know if we're going to get to actually get close to the airport. Like I said, I apologize for the wind. We're on the main highway here. actually heading back to the hotel but we're coming a different way whereas last time we actually were last time we were like walking up from woods and all that well now we're coming down we're actually going the other way 
I was heading up to Rosa there. Alright, so I don't know. Car is going by. Uh I don't know if you see this. That's part of the airfield. Strip. That is actually part of the airfield. And this is part of the airport. Car went by. Um it goes pretty far back. I actually don't know how far back it goes. I haven't been here in years. I know that uh It isn't that far from Community Park. Hang on, guys. A lot of traffic coming by. So, lately, Community Park is somewhere around there, over that way. Yeah. So, bad. <coughs> so, that is the strip. And. I don't know if you'll be able to see how far. They'll see better when they go down. They can't see buildings right now. Right. So I'm trying to walk slow. So you can actually see. Um, I will say this. We've been at the hotel like 10 days now. seen Ronnie has seen a herd. I want to say about five, six helicopters and they seem like they're landing over here in our 